Hey, hey, hey everyone, it is Andrew here. We are looking at the Rumpel Nano Loft Blanket. Rumpel makes a lot of blankets, but the Nano Loft is probably my favorite. So this is their first blanket to use their synthetic alternative to down. But in our testing, it is ridiculously comfortable and so warm. They highlight a few of the features that we're gonna to touch on here in the little getting started guide, including their cape clip, which is a brilliant move, and then their corner clips, which makes it even better for just taking this outside of your house, going and exploring with this. And it is so durable, so rugged, there's a lot to love with this blanket. So the blanket comes in two different sizes, the one person and two person size. This is the one person size, which measures 52 inches by 75 inches. The blanket on the outside is made of a 100% recycled 30D ripstop polyester fabric and has a 90 over 10 DWR, which is the durable water repellent, which makes it not only repel water, but it also makes it quite stain resistant as well. It comes in a water resistant stuff sack, which one is just beneficial to hold your blanket when it's not being used, but you can also use that stuff sack when you're out. So you're camping, you have the blanket, you have it on, you're staying nice and warm, it starts to rain and you have some gear that you wanna make sure it stays wet, you can throw it in here. It'll keep a little bit more dry. You shouldn't have any issues with anything getting wet inside of the stuff sack, kind of like a dry bag. Now the blanket does go in very easily. We'll wrap it up at the end of this video. So it does easily go back into that stuff sack when not in use. So looking at a couple of the really cool features of the Nanolog blanket, first is the cape clip. So it is two parts and this is designed for a single person use here. So basically it's got a little snap on clip on one side and a nylon loop on the other. So you throw the blanket over your shoulders, connect the cape clip, and you can feel free to walk around your campsite or around your home with the cape or the blanket around your shoulders. It is a great way to keep the blanket on you at all times, staying so snugly warm uh, without having to use your hands to hold it. Then you have these new kind of paracord things on the corners. These are great tie downs. So whether you're using this to protect something, you're using it as a uh, kind of picnic blanket and you wanna stick the stakes into the ground to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. I love the fact they have those little uh, loops on the corners of this blanket. So the two things really left to talk about are the durability, the make of it, and the warmth. This blanket is warm. It is probably the warmest blanket that Rumpel makes. So this is their state-of-the-art nano loft insulation, 100% post-consumer recycled material. One blanket actually is made up of 50 recycled plastic bottles, but you would not tell that this is some sort of recycled material. It is comfortable as hell. It is so light, so warm. This is easily my go-to blanket. I absolutely love how warm it is. It has tiny little, basically, clusters of that synthetic material that mimic down while being more eco-friendly and just being even a little bit warmer than your normal down blanket. These blankets hold up very well. We've taken it out with the dog, we've thrown it in our seats, we've covered stuff in them, we've had it out when it rains. We have put this thing through the ringer and it works great. It still looks good, it is easy to pack back up. You can throw it in your washer if this thing gets too dirty, even though it is stain resistant and everything, but if it gets muddy from the dogs, throw it in the washer, it'll clean right up. I just cannot say enough good things about this blanket. It's a little more pricey than your average blanket, but I think it is entirely worth it. So if you want to learn more, follow the link down below in the description, and I want to hear what you guys think. So go over on Twitter and reach me at Andrew underscore OSU.